Hello, I'm Su Fujimoto, an architect, and I designed uh, the Serpentine Pavilion 2013. So today I am now design one more new uh, pavilion. And uh, I don't have plan yet, so I start to make something and then the making something and the thinking uh, what it is is going almost simultaneously. It's like more like a, how to say improvisations. And I use uh, today I use this paper because it's simple and it's easy to to cut or sometimes it's easy to how to say tear 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 off. And of course you can use your hand to 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 make it whatever kind of shape as you like. Then I, I will use this because it's quite easy to to put them together and strong enough. And sometimes I, I, I like to use this because maybe it's it has some different textures. Uh, but uh, I don't know yet how to do. These kind of uh, rough textures and uh, the textures or lines of the sharp cutting edge is also inspire me. It is something different. And of course now it is paper, but uh, every time I use this kind of a uh, model materials, I try to imagine wh what is the meaning of this rough uh, cutting line and what is the meaning of the sharp edge or what is the materials. It could be something different. It should have some di different textures. So that's the, that's the exciting point. Personally, I like this kind of a uh, open end feelings not 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 like not make the space like this is but more like a more, more like this because it is more melting into the surroundings or to have more connections or communication with the surroundings So it is like a like an architectural landscape in a sense, or it's like a, the representation of the I don't know trees, one trees or one forest. The size of the people maybe something like this. So it is 15 meter something high. It's, it's really a bit big as a pavilion, but uh, mm, it, it is something I think. <laughs> <laughs> 